So I'm here to talk about the Lupine Tesla, Lupine Tesla 4. Um, it sells for $420. It's rated at 700, 700 lumens. Um, and we tested it to be around 52 lux on our light meter. So this, this came out earlier this year and it quickly became one of our favorite lights because of the compact design. This is the battery. You could uh, mount it easily on your stem and this one right on the bar. So uh, pretty hassle free. You can also mount it on your helmet. What we love about the light is its simplicity of design and it just works. You know, basically you turn it on by one click. It's got a blue indicator. It's got a beautiful beam pattern, um, a very wide and a, and a in a very bright spot and then you can put it in low mode and high or low medium and high uh, and to turn it off you just press it for a couple seconds and it shuts off the mounting system is just a simple band type uh, this one band accommodates both small and oversized bars we initially complained that it was hard to get on oversized bars it just needed to stretch uh, and I just needed to develop some some muscle but I was able to figure it out so but uh, like most lights of this type um, you're not really able to aim it left to right you know you're dependent on the um, the the angle of your bar on a right on a flat bar you're pretty much centered on a riser bar you could be angled just just a tat a touch to the right but Again, find a, I found a fix for that. If, if, if and when I had a problem, I just put a little shim on one side and, and I was able to center it. So, perfect execution um, on, the, on the Lupine Tesla. Really, there's not much to complain. But the only complaint is there's a lot of copycats now with this. There's cheaper lights. Uh, this is a 420 bucks. Uh, German design, German manufacturer, so the quality is robust. But, you know, if you can't, a lot of people are um, not at that level uh, of, um, of purchase. So it, um, it's having to compete with uh, much cheaper lights. So here it is. Let me show you the beam pattern. It's just a, like I said, a beautiful, usable pattern. I often ride with this light alone. And we'll shine this on my test setup here. So it, it ramps up slowly and then it goes into full blast and you'll see a center spot and that allows you to see very far away. But the lights of this, this is a, a Sol P7 emitter, the lights of this caliber with a reflector, you have a very well-defined halo, I call it. Um, and you can see a lot of the trail, a lot of the turns with that halo and it's got a little design on the on the ends <laughs> which uh, which is not super useful but I, I like it it looks cute so there you go lupine tesla one of the um, best lights made but now um, uh, having to compete against uh, a bunch of new lights thank you